All right, what we're going to do now is a, a, a sequence, a ball control sequence, where we're really going to um, ask our players to focus on a, a few different things, really working on concentration and take them through a, a sequence of four different activities. The first step in this process is going to be a two ball passing sequence. We like this because they have to really focus on the ball that they're passing in the air back and forth. They also have to be rolling a ball on the ground uh, back and forth at the same time. So they're having to divide their attention, still execute a skill, and I think it helps them stay low, which we, we want when they're passing anyway. So this is what the first step of this sequence looks like. Peripheral vision is really important in this drill, so they're focusing on that ball hitting their platforms. At the same time, they can see that ball on the ground, adjusting their feet, making sure they're making good move movements to maintain good ball control. Staying low, being efficient with the skill is, is very important as well. The next two phases of this sequence involve uh, a ball with six numbers on it. So on each side of the ball, we have the numbers one through six. Uh, and what we're gonna ask our players to do is just focus on the last number they see before the ball contacts their arms. So uh, not too difficult, but it really gets them watching that ball all the way into their platform. And then what we'll do is, what, is ask them to call out the first number they see as the ball crosses the net, then the last number they see as it hits their platform. Helps get their platforms out early and really focus on that ball flight. Step three, we'll then we'll go right, uh, right from two to three, we'll enter the mini balls and we'll make them do some passing repetitions with the mini volleyballs. And this is really important for making sure they're centering the pass, making a good solid platform and attempting to execute that skill. So here's what this will look like, steps two and three. All right, here we go. It's pretty important in this, this drill that you don't put too much spin on the ball. You don't need to make it difficult. We're just really emphasizing proper execution, really seeing that ball, focusing on that ball all the way to their arms. Nice job. All right, team, now we're going to ask you to identify the first number you see as the ball crosses the net. It's a little bit more challenging. And then the last number you see before it hits your arms. All right, here we go. Good, nice job. Good focus. And they really have to find that little part of the ball and then see it all the way into their platform. Good, that was a perfectly still ball and a same number both times. Great, really nice job. Keep it up. Awesome. And then just to make it difficult, we could do one of those. All right, let's switch to the mini balls. So now we'll, we'll do the mini balls. Really important that we move our feet. Strong early platforms and really keeping that chin down, seeing the ball all the way to your platform. Here we go. Nice job. Good platform, Kylie. Good platform. Good, Kurt. Way to move your feet. Okay, it's all about focus. See that ball all the way in. This is a challenging, challenging ball to pass. These are really mini balls. They're only about five inch, inches uh, in diameter. So this is, this is tough. But if you can pass a mini ball, it feels a lot easier when you get to, when you get to the real ball. Good, Kelsey, great pass. All right. So step four is just adding in a, a live ball. So here we go, we'll bowl some balls over. This ball should feel more like a beach ball right now than a volleyball. So simple progression. Really helps with the focus. Nice pass, way to go. All right, great job, way to go. 
Uh, let's get free ball, down ball service, Steve, set up on both courts.